little right there at the edge. Just trim it off. Okay, now I'm going to do the other side. So the same thing that I did on the other side, I'm doing it to this side. All right. show you what it looks like. And this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. See? Right here, that's what it looks like. Okay, now we're almost done. We're fixing to do the top part. Now, what this is how I do it. Whatever you have left, I usually will fold it in half. Fold your bias tape in half. Let's see, how many links do I have here? I've got a lot. Um... Crease it, crease it in the middle, and this is going to tell you how long of ties. necessarily have to use bias tape. You can use ribbon. I'm just trying to see how far I need to go with this. Because I'm going to tie, I'm going to do my ties first. I'm going to stitch this down and then go and stitch this. So that's how I'm going to do that. So, um, I'm just going to mark right there. So I'm going to open up my bias tape. And 
where I've got the middle of my pocket is where I put the middle of my bias tape at. And I've got them marked. So all I got to do is just lay it. But you can create this apron, like I was saying, you can create this any way you want. You don't have to do it exactly like how I'm doing it. Um, you know, get creative with it. If you want more pockets than just four, you can do ribbon. Um, I mean, it's just basically taking two pieces of fabric you're you're making your pockets and your apron so you know you get creative with this this is this is you know your apron your child's apron you get creative with it i mean that's why i was giving you the two measurement pieces because you don't necessarily have to do what i'm doing um, I'm just kind of showing you another way, um, because the other way I did it, I took bias tape and did it all the way around, but I'm doing it this way, and I kind of figure out, I kind of like this way a little better. So, you get, you get creative with it. That's, that's what's going to make... I need to take, I'm going to take a little piece of fabric here. Okay, now I'm going to stitch part of my tie down like this. straight go all the way down with it I'm just stitching all the top done.
and we're almost done. As soon as I stitch this other little tie here together, After I get this done, we're done. We are done. All right, we are done with this apron. And voila, look at there. You got your ties. Let me see if I can lift you up now so you can see it. And you even got enough for you. So it could be a child, adult. So you have enough to tie around. But there is your finished product. And you got your apron. You can even make this for your craft apron. You know, in your sewing room, you can do that too. Um, a little child's apron, they can get in there and help cook. It's just however you want to do it. Um, but I kind of like that way better so i hope you like this tutorial please uh give it a please like and subscribe leave comments down below and let me know what you think okay talk to you later bye bye